I hope I'm not out of line by saying this, but I've noticed something in my time serving you. You see, every time I dress you, or most of the time at least, you seem to avoid looking into the mirror. At first I wondered if you were embarrassed, uh, perhaps, uh, still adjusting to having a butler helping you dress and undress. It would be understandable. But after some thought, I began to realize that it had very little to do with me. I've only known you for so long, but it's clear that even though you're capable of being very sweet and gentle, you struggle to treat yourself with the same kindness. You're not subtle, tossing your nightclothes over the mirror before I can take them from you. Here. Look. For whatever reason you feel these things about yourself, you need to know. <laughs> now you want to be shy. Come. Please. I know I am but a humble servant, but grant me this. Look. You are beautiful. Every inch of you is worthy of love, worthy of appreciation, even worthy of worship. There's no need to be humble, certainly not here between the two of us. I am proud to serve you. You, the one standing there in the mirror. You do not have to be ashamed of who you see standing there. Look at you. Magnificent. You may not believe it to be true. The voice in your head may lie and tell you all sorts of terrible things. But you can talk back. You can be bold and confident and proud to be you. Beautiful, wonderful you. <laughs> Was that a shiver down your spine? <sighs> Are my words really so... Oh. oh. I do suppose it makes sense that you're getting a bit cold. Standing here like this. Now, let's get you dressed. Your cheeks are red, you know. Mm. <laughs> I don't know what has made you feel so... at odds with yourself. Um, I can't say that you may ever tell me why, but... Uh, the why isn't exactly wh what I'm concerned about. What I am concerned about is now, here in the present. I want to see you fully embrace yourself. You deserve this. You deserve the joy of being content with yourself. I can't say that I know exactly how you're feeling. But I do know that if there's anyone who can overcome a struggle like this, then it's you. You've overcome far greater challenges. <sighs> now, as you go about your day, I want you to stand tall, chin held high, bold and strong. And if you'll feel like you're about to falter, say the word, and I'll reassure you. We have quite the day ahead of us, do we not? You mentioned wanting to discuss a, uh, a party. Well, <laughs> I think that if we put our heads together, we may be able to come up with 
something suitable for someone with taste such as yourself. Come, let us begin our day.